So it's the end of the year, time to reflect, think about all the stuff you did, didn't do, all that jazz. And I feel like as a creator, I've finally hit that point where I'm, I'm happy. I'm content. I have been trying to find what I want to do for so long and I'm there. I did it. So with Escaping Carcosa, I, I'm creating this story where we're, we have a whole visual component, character art, animations. It's basically like my own little rudimentary TV show and adding stuff to it, improving it along the way. And that's what I wanted. I never realized that. I never realized this was the thing that I was trying to get towards. And now my goal's right there. It's right in front of me. And all I have to do is keep working at it and enjoy it and not chase after the numbers, not chase after like seeing, um, I guess your idea of what success is. My idea of what success has changed. It used to be, you know, all those numbers and everything, and it feels good. And there's nothing wrong with that being your idea of success. But for me, my idea of success has changed from, you know, getting eyes on something to making something that I just truly love, that I'm just having such a great time with. I'm excited to work on it. Every time I get to sit down, do some art for it, write up some more of the story, you know, work with the players, work with Michaela, the other GM and all that. I'm, I'm thrilled. It is so rewarding. It is so much fun and I can take my time. I don't have to run after this anymore. I don't have to search everywhere for what it is that is going to make me happy as far as being a creator goes. And it is so freeing that I no longer have to run. I can just walk at my own pace and I'm going to continue to do so. And I think 2024, that's just going to be me enjoying the creative process. No more trying to find like the next marketing thing that's really big. No more trying to just really break through and find a cool thing for the scene. It is enjoying this thing I am truly loving making and then making it better and better and better. And I look forward to the next projects I work on knowing now what it is that I am having fun with. So if you're a creator out there, you're hitting that end of the year, there's a lot of dread, you know, reflection, maybe joy. Uh, you know, we're often pretty hard on ourselves. Think about what's your success? What is your version of success? What does it mean for you as a creator? Because you might have just been running for a long time with someone else's version of success. And that's why you're not happy. So what does it mean to you? What do you want from it? Think about that for the end of the year. Bye now, everyone.